Ashiana Housing. Well, this is one of the most popular construction company out there. But question is, how is it in terms of investment? Is it an investment worthy stock or not? So let's find out in this video where I'll do the complete analysis of Ashiana Housing fundamentals and price action. And by the end of this video, you will be clear that if you should consider investing in this stock or not. But please remember that this is not a stock recommendation video at all. This is just an educational and informational video, right? With that said, let's get started. Okay. Hello everyone and welcome back to another video of Financial Impulse. So this is Asiana Housing and this is the screener page. So first of all, I would like to bring your focus to this point. See, Asiana's core business model is to buy land and turn it into residential building and sell it. Okay. So this is the main core business. Okay. We just got the idea what it is exactly doing. Okay. And uh, you can see Asiana Housing is a principal business activity of the company uh, of the company is real estate development okay as we just read okay so now i'm going to show you the official website of asian housing this is the official website and i'm going to share the link in the description section i would uh, request all of you to please go through it so that you can get to know more about this company okay and what kind of uh, project it is uh, undertaking and what all things it is doing everything you will get to know right we will focus on the investment perspective okay so let's come to the basic numbers first so the current price of asiana housing is 387 okay with a market cap of slightly under 4000 crore reserve 750 crore and debt 148 crore which is very good okay the numbers are looking good and the debt to equity ratio is 0 0.99 very healthy last three years average sales growth is 57.41 which is looking very good three years average profit growth 150 percent and earning per share growth three years average 152 percent excellent numbers okay current ratio uh, is a uh, 1.59 i'm sorry i think yeah current ratio or i think this is the inventory uh, no sorry this is the return on asset return on asset and return on capital employed okay so 1.59 5.01 i know these numbers are looking uh, low but this is the uh, scenario with all the other companies okay and more or less same so in the construction company real estate development this is the ideal number so you can uh, consider it safe okay not a very big red flag or anything interest coverage ratio we have is 53 which is very very high and which is very good you can see the other companies are having very less in comparison and uh, current ratio is 1.57 this is a very good number operating profit margin 10.23 okay and promoter holding is 61.11 so all these numbers are looking uh, fine no problem at all and uh, the altman z score is 4.01 and you can see other companies are having more or less same so all these things are looking fine no major red flag with asiana asiana's asiana housings um, you know basic numbers okay now we have to see if this stock is growing year on year or not so we'll come to the profit and loss statement so here there is something very interesting which you need to focus on okay so we will consider the last three years performance see the sales in march 2020 was, uh, 22 was 222 crores which went up to 407 crores in 2023 and again it went up further to 944 crores so this is more than double than what it was in uh, 2023 okay this is clearly showing the demand of this stock okay and how nicely the sales are growing okay operating profit so it was in loss okay here in march 2022 it was in loss minus 9 crore then the pro operating profit went up multifolds to 28 crore then again multifolds to 97 crore so clear indication of strong sign of u-turn which we should uh, which is the thing we should be always looking for in a stock okay an emerging stock now obviously we are going to see the same scenario with earning per share as well you can see minus 0 0.69 which went up to 2.72 then 8.30 so very healthy numbers very good sign of growth okay now let's go to shareholding pattern and see if there is any major increase or decrease uh, you know by the promoters or the smart money so the promoters are holding 61.11 percent uh, since june 2021 okay it was 61.22 so slight decrease 0 0.11 uh, we can ignore it but at the same time you can see the fis have raised the stake significantly from 0. Point, just 0. 0.34 percent to 8.28 percent and if you consider uh, compare it with last two quarters we can see there is sign of growth in stake by the uh, fis okay they have increased the stake now di is 
uh, here have almost kept the stake same not much of a difference 7.33 7.08 almost same slight decrease okay but overall picture is looking very stable the company is having very strong uh, you know uh, strong holding by promoters and the smart money which is what makes this company a very good uh, you know candidate for investment on the basis of fundamentals alone okay and this is all about the fundamentals and uh, if you are watching the video so far please hit the like button and subscribe to financial impulse if you have not done already now we'll go to the price section so this is asiana housing's price section and you can see in uh, last few months the stock has actually shown very good sign of growth okay in terms of share price you can see from here if you consider from june 2022 it has given already multiple return 229 percent return in almost two years two years less than two years okay now coming to the current scenario so we can see that asiana housing after hitting this point of around 340 sharply came down okay it came down sharply but then we get to see a big gap of opening here and the and another big candle uh, green candle followed it okay now let's check the volume for this complete price action okay if i enable the volume i can see that these two big candlesticks okay are uh, supported by two big volume bars okay so this is clear indication that this is a strong move okay not a partial move you know weak move this is a very strong move now the question is how can we identify the perfect entry point if this is already proven as a good company so in order to answer that first of all we'll see some basic moving averages which are providing support to this stock so i will start with 200 days okay 200 days is little bit far away so we should consider the near next one 150 so 150 is giving very good support and you can see earlier when 150 moving average was touched by the st uh, stock price it went up sharply then again it has touched recently and we get to see three big green candles now question is where is the perfect entry point you know to find that out what i'm going to use is the fib extension okay so i'll use this one this point this point and this point okay and i will extend it and i can see that the ideal entry point is somewhere in between this 353 to 362 so 355 360 we can say okay and you can see after giving a sharp move here of back to back four days okay the stock uh, has weakened here it looks weak okay kind of a doji pattern and you can see there uh, that is the point where it has already faced resistance earlier as well so now the chances are that the stock will give a pullback here okay there are chances okay it's not a confirmation but there are chances so i would say that uh, you should bet uh, you should be looking for other parameters so what are the other parameters so we have to check the momentum indicators so when i enable the momentum indicators i am seeing that the macd has given a crossover okay it is staying above zero and that has given a crossover which is a good thing but at the same time we can see a sharp jump in the rsi level as well so this is something uh, we should you should be careful about because you know when a sir, uh, when a stock jumps sharply from a point okay from a bottom point to the top point in one go then it does not last you know the trend does not continue okay it will definitely give a pullback retracement that does not mean the beginning of a downtrend so what i expect the stock to do is it could come to this level and then go and by that time you can see the rsi level coming here using this 50 level is it as a support and then bouncing above 60 this could happen so what we have to do we have to see the price action for next few days keep this stock in your watch list this is a construction company and if you are looking for a quality construction company then this stock is one of the best candidates you you have out there okay don't miss out on this one just keep this keep this in your mind and uh, keep this stock in your watch list okay and let's say you are making an entry at the price of around uh, 360 okay and the stock is giving a retracement and you are making an entry there so the question is where is the profit taking target for you if you are a swing trader okay so your profit taking target will be here you see the middle part of 141 and 161 percent like always okay and i would say 460 is looking like a good number okay this will be the first target the second target will be 530 let's say okay now let's measure how much percentage of return that will be if you make an entry even at 360 so here is 360 if i measure this is 29.55 30 percent almost and here it is 
फोर्टी सिक्स परसेंट सो फोर्टी फाइव सो थर्टी परसेंट फोर्टी फाइव परसेंट रिटर्न एंड यू कैन अचीव दिस इन सिक्स मंथ्स टू वन ईयर और मैक्सिमम वन एंड हाफ ईयर ओके डिपेंडिंग ऑन द सेक्टर ओके सो दिस इज लुकिंग लाइक ए वेरी गुड अपॉर्चुनिटी टू मी एंड इफ यू आर इंटरेस्टेड टू इन्वेस्ट इन ए कंस्ट्रक्शन कंपनी क्वालिटी कंपनी देन दिस स्टॉक इज वन ऑफ देम ओके एंड दैट इज ऑल अबाउट आसियाना हाउसिंग बट प्लीज लेट मी जस्ट रिमाइंड यू दैट दिस इज नॉट अ स्टॉक रिकमेंडेशन वीडियो ओके यू कैन यूज द इन्फॉर्मेशन प्रोवाइडेड इन दिस वीडियो एड इट विथ योर ओन एनालिसिस एंड देन मेक द फाइनल कॉल इफ यू वॉन्ट टू इन्वेस्ट इन इट और नॉट ओके आई जस्ट हेल्प यू इन फाइन ट्यूनिंग योर एंट्री ओके एंड ऑल्सो इन एसेसिंग द बेसिक इंपोर्टेंट नंबर ऑफ ए स्टॉक Okay, and I hope this video was helpful and informative. Please hit the like button and subscribe to Financial Impulse if you have not done already. And if you are already a subscriber and finding my videos valuable, consider joining the Financial Impulse community where you will get more stock analysis. And also, don't forget to check my other channel, Financial Affairs One Zero One. You will find the link in the description section. Thank you for watching. Bye.